Estevan Salvation Army kicked off its kennel campaign at the Estevan Shoppers Mall a couple weeks ago, and so far things have been going well. Local MLA Dorian Eagles, Mayor Gary St. Ange, and others were on hand for the kickoff ceremonies. St. Ange said the Salvation Army is always there to help the community. Yeah, and it's always a big campaign, um, this campaign that happens every year, and, and the Salvation Army, of course, works so hard uh, all year to help our community be a better place to live. And as was mentioned, we certainly had uh, trials and tribulations this year, and uh, not only the Salvation Army and other groups, but a tremendous number of people from our community came out and helped out. So uh, you find out uh, what kind of a community you have when you have tough times happening. The key to the Kettle campaign is the people in our community, and Major Len Millar explained there are three ways of people to help. Uh, there's three ways in which you can do it. First of all is that uh, uh, those that donate money, and that is one, one area that, uh, and we certainly value and appreciate that. Also, they're giving two hours of your time, and that's very expensive for some people, too. And willingly giving up their time at no cost to us to be able to stand and ring those bells um, and to greet people. And, that's a, and the third people, so it's like a three-win situation. The third group that win are really the people that will re be receiving a Christmas hamper this year. So we appreciate it. We cannot do it by ourselves. It's a, it's a partnership with many people, many groups and organizations, and certainly the um, Hamper Association here in Estevan is brilliant. It just amazes me how they come together as a community group and uh, we work together so we need I think we need each other and it's all for a good cause. The Christmas season and Salvation Army go hand in hand and it's important for the group to collect as much money as possible over the holidays. So the goal is 69,000. Last year we collected 70,000 so it's not really up from what we made last year but we believe that this will be a, a total that uh, will help us at Christmas time and then carry throughout the year. So there's no other expenses, and as I say, this is the only time we, we ask for, for financial donations uh, in, in, uh, uh, to, to support us throughout the year. The Kettle campaign is more than halfway over, and Millar said they are at 65% of their goal. He added they are right on track to meet it. The community has done a great job supporting the campaign again this year. Millar said 85% of the volunteers at the Kettles have been from the community. There's still time left for people to help. Millar said they are still looking for volunteers for the week of December 19th. For Estevanmercury.ca, I'm Reese Kelso.